everyone welcome back to the channel so here we are discussing the question palindromic prime numbers on courtship so the problem states that a palindromic prime number is a positive integer that is both a prime number meaning it has exactly two divisors one and itself and a palindrome in base 10 means it reads the same both backwards and forwards leading zeros are not considered by data mining if a number is a palindrome so 20 is not a palindrome even though it can be written as 0 to 0. You are given an integer n. Consider n palindromic prime numbers. How many of them have an even number of digits and odd number of digits? You need to print that. So here are some examples are given. You can go through it. I am skipping it and going to the test cases. So on the test cases, first of all, we have one. So for n equal to 1, the first palindromic prime is 2 and it has only one digit. So it is odd number of digit, hence the output is 0, 1. For 4 also, no even digits. So the output is 0, 4 as we have 2, 3, 5, 7 as our four palindromic primes. Now for the third test case, we have 8. So first 8. Palindromic primes are 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 101, 131, and 151. So, of course, 11 has two digits, and everything else is either one or three digits, which are odd. So, we have one even and seven odd numbers. So, we have printed one, seven. Now, how to go to the solution? First of all, what we need to check. We can check either way. First, we can check if the number is prime, or we can check if the number is palindrome. So, first, I check if a number is prime. If yes, I need to check if the number is palindromic. So, if the number is prime, if the number is palindromic, then what I will do? I will check the length of the number there itself and if I got the number even I have a even counter and a odd counter so if the length is even it will be even plus one and if the length is odd it will be odd plus one and finally you can return the even count comma the odd counter so now if you go to this solution, you know check, uh, checking the palindrome and checking the prime all together, it will increase your prime complexity and so if you check the time complexity, it would be too high that it is not suitable for the constraints of the question and it will give you a TLE that is time limit exceeded error. Now, how to resolve this time limit exceeded error? The smallest solution to this is generate a list of all the prime palindromic numbers through your code separately and then use that list in this code. And from that list, you need to find out just the first n numbers and figure them out even or odd and do even plus 1 or odd plus 1. And this would give us the final solution. Like uh, I have created one code to find the prime palindromic numbers. So first I will check if my number from starting is same as my number from end you can get these simple codes on web if you don't know how to code it and for prime numbers you can simply check that the number is not divisible by any other number then we start divisibility from 2 so like this you check and generate the list and 
don't forget to check both the conditions after that you go through these conditions as well of even and odd to get this out so i hope you all understand this solution hope it works and resolve the tla error which you might be facing if you are trying to implement this in code thanks for watching